the Gorian Gathering Place podcast, sharing about the Gorian philosophy, the Gorian ethos, and the Gorian lifestyle. Now, here is your host, Rocker. Hi, everyone. Uh, thank you for joining me today. Uh, first of all, I have to uh, give a shout out to uh, uh, some of the guys from the assembly. Is They went out and they had this shirt printed for me. Uh, Alec, the man, the myth, the legend. And uh, basically it's uh, just a take off of what's been happening on online. They've been getting quite a kick out of it as far as uh, everyone's getting their panties in a naughty over in a knot over in the, the old Coliseum or the round table, which is quite comical. Um, and then it seems like every topic that comes up is that it automatically reverts back to attacking me, which uh, it's good to know that I'm, I'm in their heads and that uh, that they're pretty well all fucked up over there, is that, that I seem to be enemy number one. And uh, it, it's just comical to watch. So anyhow, uh, tonight, first of all, Rock and Rumble down at Kitchener City Hall is taking place. Um, we have roughly about 600 bikes that are going to be showing up. Uh, Honeymoon Suite and a couple of other bands are going to be playing on the main stage in, in Carl Civic Square. So, so come out for that. Uh, you'll find me over by the security desk as usual. And, um, and a lot of the people from the assembly are involved as far as the, um, being involved in the first aid uh, booth and and also run in security so that's going to be a great night we're expecting uh, literally about anywhere between eight and nine thousand people to show up so that's an exciting time put on by the city of Kitchener uh, but there's going to be a lot of people down there and it's just going to be a great party it starts at five o'clock and it goes to eleven o'clock tonight so again rock and rumble uh, just google it and it'll come up and it's uh, always a great time every year is, uh, just gets bigger and bigger so first of all uh, just get that out of the way Secondly, today what I want to talk about is um, the fact that Gorians sh should be exclusive. Uh, there's been a major push lately, especially over in the round table, uh, to not make it that way. And there was even a post happened a couple of days ago, which was a bounce off of a post that I made in the Gorian gathering place about, uh, about um, false um, teachings regarding free women. And Bear ended up running with it and taking it over there. And of course, you had a whole bunch of uh, people commenting, and then he ran it over to uh, to a spotters group and you know that kind of things, which is all quite comical because it doesn't mean absolutely shit. Uh, you know, if you're not Gorian, uh, you don't have a say in anything. And most of those people are definitely ignorant. But to show how ignorant that Bear is, is that he made a posting, and and in it was uh, attention all Gorian all, all free women. And then he said to all Gorian um, free women, uh, to all free women, Gorian or not, you know, which really raised an eyebrows. And and, and there's a you know, had a few people uh, this morning when we were setting up the stage, uh, having a good chuckle about it. Is uh, you know, if you are not Gorian, you are not a free woman. You are not a free man. You're not a free anything. Is that is a position and a title that is specifically for Goreans. You know, and what it is I want to explain in a little bit more detail. You know, if you are saying that all free people, whether they are Gorean or not, which basically I'm assuming what Bear's talking about is, is people that are perceived to be dominant, what do you do with the majority of people in the world that don't um, identify as dominant or submissive? They're just regular vanilla people. Not only that, but if you have a slave, or Kajira, you know, how is she supposed to identify someone, a banker, down at the bank, that's not Gorian? Are they a free person? Does she identify him and call him master? You know, it's just a whole bunch of nonsense. Free people, Kajira, is specifically within the Gorian community. It specifically identifies within Gorian society. To be able to say that, you know, to all free women, Gorian or not, is absolute, it's just, it's just incredible. The teachings and the way of thinking that's going on over in Silk and Steel and over in the Round Table is, it, it, it's just utter stupidity. You cannot find that anywhere in the books. It goes against the realm of reason. 
you know, it just blows my mind. But anyhow, that's what's being taught and the way of thinking is the fact that, you know, all oh, we want to make it all inclusive and, and we want to invite everybody in and everyone's a free person or they're a slave. And it's like, no, 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 no. 99% of the world's population is, doesn't identify as either dominant or submissive. And you can't put that on Kajiras and on slaves to be able to have to sort through all that on their own. You know, it's just absolute, utter ridiculous to be able to promote and to be able to say that all free women, Gorian or not, is like, no. It's specifically within the realm of Gorians. If you are not Gorian, you are not a free person. You know, if you are not Gorian, you should not be calling yourself a Kajira. Call yourself a slave, a submissive, whatever. But those terms are specifically within and identify with the Gorian philosophy and the Gorian books. It's fairly simple. But to try to lump everybody in is just absolute ridiculous. And it should it's utterly blasphemy as far as I'm concerned. But that's the way of thinking that happens. And this has been happening in Silk and Steel. And, and Bear promotes that regularly within the round table. So anyhow... I uh, just wanted to talk about that just briefly is that, you know, is, you know, when you hear people talking like that, it's wrong. You know, they're trying to include everybody in order to be politically correct, to, to create a more softer, gentler gore, which is not the case at all. You know, gore is supposed to be harsh. Gore is supposed to be exclusive. And to have wing nuts like this and people that water things down in order to be accepted or to try to pump up their numbers is just absolute stupidity and it's just simply wrong. You know, Bear, you're wrong on that, plain and simple. You know, is gore, in, uh, is gore is for Goreans. It's not for everybody. That's something you seem to always miss. Anyhow, you guys have a great weekend. Again, uh, thanks for the t-shirt guys. And if you happen to be uh, available today between 5 and 11 o'clock, rock and rumble. Kitchener City Hall, Civic Center. Take care.